This tutorial describes the getting started procedure for an EPOS 4 positioning controller. The new project wizard, a tool from the EPOS Studio, allows to set up the communication interface for the connected device with just a few steps. On the installation guide that comes with the EPOS 4 hardware, you find the internet address epos.maxenmotor.com. From this Maxenmotor landing page for the EPOS family, you can download the EPOS Studio software for free. The EPOS Studio is needed to parametrize and set up the EPOS hardware. Open the website epos.maxenmotor.com in your web browser, scroll down and click on the Download EPOS Setup button. The download starts as soon as you have chosen Save As and specified a path for saving the zip file. Unzip the download file and start the installation process of the EPOS Studio software by clicking on the unzipped .exe file. Connect the power supply or logic supply input of the EPOS 4 positioning controller to your power supply. Use a USB cable type A, micro B to connect the EPOS 4 to your computer. After the USB driver is installed, you can start the EPOS Studio by clicking on the respective icon on your computer desktop. After starting the EPOS Studio, the new project window starts automatically. We create a new project first. In step 1 introduction, select a project related to your connected EPOS device. In our case, this is the EPOS 4 project. Press Next. In step 2 settings, we enter a project name and select a path to save our project. Press Finish. Our project file is successfully saved. At the same time, the project name with the associated controller appears in the workspace window. Press OK for confirmation. All windows are closed. At the same time, the red cross on the EPOS 4 node 1 in the workspace window disappears. The EPOS 4 controller is now connected. Click on the communication button to open the communication navigation pane. The communication tree with the local host, that's our computer, the USB port of the computer, the USB connection and the USB device, in our case the EPOS 4, is displayed. The EPOS 4 device is now ready for the startup. See the separate video tutorial for the explanation of the startup wizard.